We have some predictions for upcoming Blacklight Funko Pops. Let's talk about it. Blacklight Funko Pops are amazing, and if you don't think so, you can tune in tomorrow. Hopefully it won't be about Blacklight anything. So we've gotten Five Nights at Freddy Blacklight. Marvel Blacklight. I was gonna say I know that those are your grails. The Five Nights at Freddy's. No, they're not my grails. Why would you say that? Because they're your favorite. You know I don't own them. I don't own them. Don't say that. Are you embarrassed? No. He's so embarrassed. Five I'm not embarrassed. Can you stop saying that? I know they're not. Pops. That's not true. Okay, but that Chica. No. Five Nights at Freddy's, Marvel, DC, and we're about to get some Alice in Wonderland soon. Can we talk about the fact that Alice in Wonderland hasn't been released yet? I got the biggest prediction ever. You want to hear it? Sure. You're going to have to wait because head over to patreon.com slash castlecast to find out all the ways that you can support the channel. Yes, you, my friends, can support the channel and get some awesome perks in return. So head over to patreon.com slash castlecast to find out more. Are you ready? Sure. My big prediction. Put on your seatbelt. Alice in Wonderland. They're coming soon. When are they coming? I don't know. How do you know they're coming so soon? Because I just know. I know somebody on the inside. No, you don't. You heard it from Funko's live video or whatever. No, I didn't. They said coming soon. She's on to you. Say something. No, they didn't. So really quick, before we get into the predictions, do you want to predict when the Alice in Wonderland Funko Pops will drop? Mm, I said right around the time of the anniversary. At least it would be in July. That's my thought. Possibly next Friday. So many people said that they were going to be coming out this week, and I do not think that they will be coming out tomorrow. Tomorrow is a drop day. Mm, people are saying it's Friday. It's going to happen on Friday. No, people said Monday. And then mm. when they didn't come Monday, they said, oh, well, they'll be here Wednesday. They didn't come Wednesday. No. And now they're saying, oh, they'll be here on Friday. I don't think that they will be here on Friday. I mean, the best thing that we can suggest that you do is on Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays, which is their typical drop day. Sometimes they do do Thursday and, and Tuesdays, but not often. Set an alarm for 1130, 12, 1230, and 1 o'clock Eastern. Oh, my God. I know. I have alarms for all of those set on all of those Monday, Wednesday, Friday days. Wow, Heather, you're prepared. I know, I am very prepared because I don't want to miss a drop. Now that we've talked a little bit about Alice in Wonderland, my first prediction, Nightmare Before Christmas Black Light Funko Pops. That's definitely coming and it's coming hard. Okay. The colors would be so cool. Like you have Sally in like her patchwork dress. Mm -hmm. That would be great. I would really love to see Jack and I would love to see him in his original colors with the white and the black. We haven't seen white black light before because like Mad Hatter and Alice, you would assume that they would be like a white color, right? Their skin, but no, they're yellow. I would love to see a bright white glow with the harsh black. Mayor? Mayor's Mayor perfect. Face especially? Yes. And Lock, Shock, and Barrel? Oh my gosh. And they could do a ride. That can be their second ride because they've done the Ghost Rider ride. They could do the Lock, Shock, and Barrel in the bathtub. Remember that? Oh yeah. That would be a cool one. Same mold, different paint. Oh, Heather, we both got ideas. We should be getting paid. Okay, well I said Nightmare Before Christmas. Where's your head at? Pokemon! No, don't oh, say that. Oh, yeah. Nightmare Before Christmas is something we could do. No, 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 for. but these aren't like things that I want to see. These are things that are coming from Funko. Ugh. And you know, they have done blocked Pokemon. They've done glitter Pokemon. They've done all these stupid Pokemons. I don't like this. They're going to do black light Pokemon. And they are bright colored. Can you imagine Pikachu or Charmander in black light? I don't want this. They're going to be really bright. But that's what Funko is going to do. They're going to do... Pokemon Blacklight. Okay, so because Star Wars is doing that whole comic booky look, and I think the comic booky stuff they're doing from Target looks fantastic, and that's the route they should go. But I'd have to be stupid not to think they're going to take one of their biggest franchises and turn it into Blacklight. And I think Mandalorian is a possibility for Blacklight. Yeah, but what's weird about Mandalorian is, with the exception of like Baby Yoda, the colors are just. Meh. That's why you put a bunch of like comic booky colors. The Mandalorian have like blues and stuff to make him pop out. Blacks. I'm down. I wouldn't mind seeing like a Mandalorian and the child. I don't know if this would happen, but I would hope that it does because we are sort of starting to see more horror again. 
I would love to see Horror Black Light. Horror Black Light would be really cool. It would be amazing. I've talked about it before. I would love to see the original Pennywise. And even the new Pennywise would be great under Black Light. Jack Torrance, but the frozen one with like the blue. Oh yeah, that would be super cool. That would be really cool. Do you think they're gonna do more Black Light sodas? Yes. The popularity of the Alice in Wonderland Funko Pops and sodas, I think this is just showing us right now, this is a glimpse what we should prepare ourselves for more realistically what we should prepare our wallets for because they're going to drop all sorts of black light funko pops on us think about it masters of the universe Ooh. that's another one that i suspect would be black light at some yes. point and those colors they would pop really really well really well and they could do sodas they could do funko pops they could do all sorts of stuff i'm also thinking teenage mutant ninja turtles oh my gosh that's yes. something else that could be on black light that would look fantastic if you really think about it for the most part i would say 80% of all the things that you like, they could black like. Five Nights at Freddy's makes sense because they have all the wacky colors. Alice in Wonderland makes sense because it's sort of psychedelic, but they have all the cool colors. Marvel, on the other hand, that's something very odd, but it works. I like that the Marvel set has more of a comic booky look. If they can make sense out of Marvel being black light, they can literally make anything black light. Absolutely. Completely agree with that. And they look so good. In person, when I saw them for the very first time, I was just blown away because you think more or less that black light is going to be more of a gimmick, but black light is here to stay. You can get all these like glow in the dark Funko Pops and yes, they look cool. You glow them for a little while and you put them on your shelf and, and they like fade. These never fade. You put a black light in your room, you have black light pops all inside your room. It's going to be ridiculous. Can you imagine what people's displays are going to turn into? Because right now people have like the baseball bat displays with the LED strips in them. Soon they're going to be filling people's rooms. Absolutely. Like I can see us taking those white lights out of your big display cases and putting in black lights there and having just all of this all black, black light lights eventually. back there. I, I, listen, that'd be super cool. It would be. Another line that I would really like to see in black light, and this is going to sound really bizarre and maybe something that you would have never thought about, Boo Hollows. That would be neat. Because if you go into a haunted house, usually there's a lot of black light. But the black light colors, they could make all these like spooky, Halloween-y sort of characters pop and I think that would be super amazing looking. It really would be. You're onto something there. I think that Funko should just scrap everything and only do black light. That's how much I love the black light Funko Pops. I'm not even a huge fan of Alice in Wonderland and I want every single item they're dropping. But I really, really want every black light Funko Pop that came out except for Five Nights. I don't want Five Nights at Freddy's. It's really weird because you have the entire Five Nights at Freddy's collection but you I back don't and, have like, you it don't though. Like Why are you saying that it's not true i might have foxy or whatever his name is heather you barely named off something you'd like to see in black light what, what kind of predictions do you have what do you mean i said pokemon uh, yeah, which was like the worst ever go ahead but it's what they're gonna do they're not doing it what i else? said i want them to do horror that's my thing i want to see horror you want to hold on to these handles Dragon Ball. Can you imagine if they did Dragon oh, Ball with the yellow that. hair and all the different cool colors they have? I mean, that's going to look ridiculous under a black light. They're, You're right. They got to do black light Dragon Ball. They will. Guys, what do you think about black light Funko Pops and what are your predictions? Let us know all of that and more in the comment section down below. In every video, we like to thank four of our patrons from Patreon for all of their support. And in this video, we'd like to thank Rudy Castillo, Tino Maldonado, Richard Perez, and Miguel Orta. Thank you so much for all of your support. We appreciate every one of you guys. Head on over to poppinofftoys.com for all your Funko Pop, Soda, and Mystery Mini needs. Poppinofftoys.com. All right, it's that time again. Remember, as always, we're going together, guys. We'll catch you next time. Bye.